Okay, it's still empty. If you see anybody coming, stop them and tell them I'm heading down with a big trailer. Okay. If you're new here, my name is Jessica. I travel full time with my husband David and our two cats. We finally found a level spot and now the cactus is blocking the solar panels, sort of, a little bit. How is it? Still good? Good side to side. Here's the view out of the other side. This is from the kitchen window. It does feel pretty private and beautiful. This is actually our second time boondocking on public land. Look how beautiful it is out here though. Did you know that Chevy makes these great tables for your coffee in the morning when you wanna just step outside? And um, look how much space we have. You cannot get this at an RV park. This did not cost us a dime and we can stay here for up to 14 days. Possible bobcat sighting. Let him in. Sun's coming out, huh? I knew you would like that. It's a little too chilly to open the windows, but he loves fresh air, so I figured he would enjoy this. Do you believe it? No. Nine miles an hour does not include Gus. There they go, little two bunnies. I'll be right back. I'm gonna go edit, okay? I've been here recording audio and she's just out. It's gonna be brighter too. So while we're here, we're gonna sweep the aluminum floor underneath. I can't wait until we have a sliding glass door so we can enjoy this view more often. What are you doing? Capping the wires. I think I see it out in the bushes. Do you see him? I think he might be coming. We might be adopting a cat. David threw some food at the cat, or to the cat, not at the cat. He's excited? He's eating the food? The cat's eating the food. 
I know I don't have a very good view of this. You got another morsel. We could bring it to John and Gwen. Hey, pretty girl. Come on. She's very stubborn. She's very stubborn. You want to go for a ride, PP? Not a care in the world. All right, let's go put out a fire. On the other side. David decided to do laundry in a plastic bin today. I don't know why I didn't think of this before, but I just placed a Whole Foods pickup order for David so he's not feeling too overwhelmed with all the errands he has to run. One thing I did notice though is they're completely out of water, like regularly priced water. They have like $5 water, but I'm not gonna buy $5 water. We'll see what he can find. They haven't had water at Walmart in a while either, the spring water. So this is what was in my foot, stuck in my big toe but the stick helped get it out. So good to remember for the future. Hopefully we'll come back here again, cause it's gorgeous. I was looking out the window and I spotted this little rodent. I don't know what it is. That must be where he lives. Last night it got below freezing down to probably the mid 20s. And tonight is going to be about the same. 
We're watching the sunset from inside today. We don't usually have the heat on this early, but we do today. And this mountain straight ahead. This is Boccaccio, and this is right off I-10 between Tucson and Phoenix, and they have a state park with camping. There is an RV park nearby too. I think it's only 55 plus though. So today is a moving day and we are headed to an RV park for a couple of days. Are you ready for another adventure? A better angle. Because over there I get that big bush. You're going to go out that way and then go around? Yeah. Let's go slow. <laughs> 